right, today we are pointing out some of the sparring rules to help people understand or if the judges forgot or the students don't know. And so it's important. So when you start the ring, the combatants should bow to the judge first, head judge right here, bow to me, and then bow to each other. Okay, now we prefer that people touch gloves before the judge says go. You don't want to touch gloves after the judge says go. So go ahead and touch gloves, back out, fighting position. Okay, as you see, we have three judges. One side judge, another side judge, and the head judge. There has to be an odd number so you have, you know, a, a way to determine, you know, two to one, three to zero, because uh, you've got four judges, it could be two to two, what do you do then? So three usually or five judges uh, are used. All right, ready and go. Stop. So the head judge, generally speaking, stops the ring. And he will ask the side judges to call the point the same time the head judge does. Why? So we don't influence each other. So when I say judges call, you'll have to immediately make your call. So ready? Judges call. All right, so this is good. You have Master Sully and myself are calling Alex's punch. It doesn't matter what the technique is, really. So we're calling the punch. Master McMillan's calling a mafia. So two to one. Alex gets the point. All right. The head judge in the CTF Texas doesn't have the power to call a point on his own. If, if these two judges see no point or they both point to a mafia and I say no, it's Alex, two, their, their two to one overrules me. So it has to be a majority. Okay. Ready, go. Stop. Okay, now the head judge does call out of the ring. The side judges can help him and, and say, wait, you know, this, he's out of the ring. But, um, so one warning out of the ring. You get three warnings. Next time it's a point to your opponent. Yeah, the idea is that you're here to fight, and if you're running away, you're going to be penalized. All right, go. Stop. Ready, judges, call. Okay, they say no, they say no, I say two points for Mafia, so it's nothing. Go. Stop. Judges. Cool. Okay, it's unanimous. Three to zero, one point to make you. Go. Stop. Judges. Cool. One point, Alex. Okay, just to point out, if I say a mafia got a kick and Master Sally and Master McMillan say she only got a punch, the lower amount is given. So my two points then becomes one point because the majority said it was one point. Go. Judges, call. Okay. Mr. Sully, Master Sully says one point Amethia. I say one point Alex. Master Villain says nothing, so it's no points. Okay, time. Bow. Now, it's tied. It's three to three. So 
So now it's sudden death. And that means the first person to get a point wins. And that's how this is done, okay? It's not, no more clock. Most fights are two minutes. And now there's no clock, it's just who scores the point first. Ready? And go. So, judges call. All right. One, two, one over here. Point wins. Winner, Val. Very good. And winner, Alex. We highly recommend that the head judge check the scorekeeper's uh, point taking after each match and make sure he, you know, got the winner correct and wasn't confused because that happens. Because head tournaments are pretty hectic and uh, so to do that. And that's another reason I raised his arm to make it clear. Most of the time, Alex will be wearing a red tassel and I may fear a white tassel. So this also helps to um, figure out who's who, especially for the scorekeeper who doesn't know them. So that would be important to understand. Thank you very much.